Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sarah here, and today I've got you a big grocery haul. This is Aldi and Walmart. Um, mainly Aldi, but some Walmart as well. So anyway, yeah, a big holiday haul, and um, let's get into it. <laughs> There's a lot here, and I need to get this stuff put away and lunch made because everybody's hungry. So let's go. you have? Penguin crackers. Okay, penguin crackers. First up on the list. Special jar. Okay, special jar. All right, where do I even start, you guys? I guess let's just start right here. Here's the so, special jar. Okay, I've got carrots, a couple cucumbers, broccoli, um, this Boston leaf lettuce. I love this stuff. We have oranges grapefruit i love grapefruit yeah. lemons um yeah. we've got a box here of sandwich baggies oranges. and we have this uh coconut water somebody i know likes that some of this stuff's gonna be random guys because i tried putting it in order but there's just a lot of stuff going on um, these fruit and grain bars, strawberry ones, Caleb picked those out. I've got some baking cocoa, it's pretty cheap at Aldi. And then the rave of the Instagram world, these Belgian cocoa dusted truffles. Cannot wait to try these and see how they are. Apparently they're amazing, okay. Also got a raspberry vinaigrette. They actually had it in stock at my Aldi. I've been waiting all year for that. <laughs> okay, we've got some oven roasted sea salt almonds. I was looking for hickory smoked, but I didn't see them. Um, sweet potatoes, onions, red apples. We've got the brioche buns for um, sandwiches. Uh, this sourdough bread, everybody in the house loves this sourdough bread from Aldi and it's really reasonably priced. These are the specialty brioche bagels. Their French toast ones were amazing. They're so soft, you guys. All right, I got four loaves of the honey wheat bread. Kids go through this like crazy for sandwiches. Everything bagels, blueberry bagels, English muffins, um, the mini naan bread, uh, the kids love this with hummus, and there is hummus on this table somewhere. Um, a sack of potatoes, love potatoes, and some lemon extract for baking. All right, I think I'll just come back around. Okay, <laughs> I've got at Walmart some griller crumbles. I think I got three bags of those. A bag of the original sausage patties for breakfast. I can't fit all of them. Okay, it's all right. You can eat the other ones. It's okay. Um, I found these here. They're actually by Morningstar, but it's incognito. And they are um, plant protein chicken nuggets. So that looked like fun. Um, I got two of the almond mozzarella and two of the almond cheddar style cheeses. Then I saw these, which, uh-oh, the box popped open. Um, they're actually by Marie Calendars, but it is plant-based and it's a fake beef pot pie. How cool is that? So they were actually like only two something, which is about the same as you would buy Which is about the same as you would buy a regular pot pie for, so happy with that. I got silk creamer, um, small trash bags for the bathrooms, uh, pine saw for mopping, and more of this cascade for the dishwasher. All right, that was Walmart. I got a bag of sweet Vidalias. Um, back to Aldi here, guys. Sorry, it's not separated. A bag of the California Mission Figs. I absolutely love these, either with almond butter or with goat cheese. They are amazing. They're just the little um, black ones. 
This was actually a Dollar Tree. <laughs> oh, the mac and cheese for some of them. Oh, there's my other box of truffles. I was wondering where it was. All right, we got some ginger, some string cheese, guacamole. I get the mild kind. It's excellent. Um, cream cheese. Uh, the goat cheese. This is just the plain. I got the quartet of hummus. It is classic. Roasted red, red pepper, roasted garlic, and cilantro jalapeno. Guys, cilantro jalapeno is my fave. We've got the um, cheese slices. That was Walmart. Um, honey goat cheese. I got a fig um, jam spread. Hello. Hi, Jill. Hi. Um, I got the honey goat cheese because I want to put it on some crackers, which... I think are the on the other side of the table, but I had gotten a fig jelly at um, Aldi or fig jam, and a while ago. And anyway, so I got that to go with it on crackers. Um, this is Walmart again. I got uh, one, two, three of the plant-based butters, and then a stick. Aldi uh, Italian dressing mix, paper plates. Um, some mandarin oranges. I guess the kids picked up those. And then four bags of mixed vegetables, which will be for pot pies. Uh, the kids wanted to do a pizza one night, so grab that. And then um, Walmart, I got two, um, three packs of uh, Kleenex. I got some tomatoes at Aldi. And then I got these Pizzellis. They're... Um, isn't that how you say it, Pizzelli? I, I believe so. These are vanilla flavor, and I'm excited about these, and I think that they're going to be fun to try. Okay, I got um, three regular creamy peanut butter and three crunchy. I love crunchy peanut butter. Um, okay, let's see here. I got garlic stuffed green olives and jalapeno stuffed green olives. Two of the Kalamata olives, artichoke hearts, and one of the green olives. Okay, let's see what canned items here that we have. I got four of the kidney beans, six refried beans. And me. You bought me. I didn't buy you. You are too precious. <laughs> I got some pineapple tidbits. I think I got two cans of those and then crushed pineapple. All right, we got the kidney beans. Um, I got two cans of garbanzo beans and then three of the um, Rotel. <clears throat> okay, we got tomato juice because, because my daughter thought she would like to have some and drink it so I'm interested to see if she likes it or not <laughs> okay what else here we've got tomato basil sauce and a couple of the marinara oh careful buddy we I needed to stock back up on my diced tomatoes so I got regular diced and then I also got the basil garlic herb ones got four cans of regular olives and then my other daughter decided she needed some berry kombucha so that's what she got Got a melon. You wanted the cantaloupe, right? Yes. Mama. Okay. okay. Mama. Yes. Where's my cup? My new cup. I oh, got. it's on the table over there. Mm -hmm. Okay. We Wait, got these apples. These apples are super good. They're sweet tango. They are New York grown, sweet crisp apple, and they are super good. We've gotten those before. All right. I got four containers of raspberries at Aldi because they were a good deal. And these came from Walmart, also a good deal, but um, yeah. Anyway, and then we also got um, the Arby's curly fries at Walmart. And then um, some cilantro at Aldi. But right as we walked into Walmart, they had like all the salsa and guacamole making supplies out. Um, or ingredients, I guess you could say. So I did get some tomatoes, avocados, lime, and a yellow onion. So we can make some of that. Uh, let's see here. Oh, I love these coconut almonds. The dark chocolate and coconut. Um, Trader Joe's has these and they are so good. So I grabbed some of those. 
And then, yeah, these are the crackers that I thought could have the um, goat cheese and um, fig jelly on. That they would be really yummy. I found those at Aldi. And then these blueberries also at Aldi. And some grands um, for pot pies, probably. All right, we had not gotten portobello for a while, so I grabbed um, a pack of those, some cabbage, and then some yogurts. We've got blueberry, cherry, raspberry, strawberry, and peach. Uh, two bunches of celery, thing of spinach, some mixed greens, grapes, bananas, green peppers. I got these French green beans, look super delicious. And some mushrooms. Um, we have zucchini and lettuce. What else, guys? Um, I think we're done. I think we're done. Wow. Okay. Um, I mean, I guess you could count in the package here of toilet paper from Walmart. <laughs> but yes, this is everything. It was a big haul. I've not been shopping for several weeks and this will last us for several weeks, but it is amazing how fast everything goes. So anyway, that's, that's the haul. All right guys, that is the grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and if you'd like to see more of these kind of hauls, just leave a little message down below and let me know. And excuse all the noise, and I hope you have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.